In 2005, the managing partner at Wolf Creek and my friend and boss, Steve Roberts, met a chaplain at the Ogden Rescue Mission. Connected and came up with the idea to have retreats for families from Hill Air Force Base um, at Wolf Creek. A lot of relationships, they have unresolved conflicts. And what happens is when they go into deployment and they haven't resolved those conflicts, those conflicts just don't go away. What ends up happening is they become more complex. We truly cannot go over there knowing that back home isn't okay, that people aren't out there trying to help our families. If things aren't okay at home, you can't do what you need to do over there. And that's what the foundation has done. It's pro it has provided a way to care for our families when we can't be there. Military families, the deployer is going out six to 10 times during a career, and they're literally missing years of their families' lives. It puts these families at great risk. So we work to help these families deal with deployment issues before they come up. What we do with the kids, to me, is the most important thing. They're making a sacrifice for our country just as surely as their parents are. And many of these families don't survive. So they work with the kids in age-appropriate ways with their fears. Um, about deployment and whether one or both their parents is going to return. I was headed to Kuwait and uh, before I went to Kuwait there was a lot of skills I needed to uh, make that six month distance between my wife and I uh, work and we focused on uh, family resiliency, uh, communication skill building and then being able to escape up into Wolf Mountain and then being able to talk about this and, and the environment and the setting in which Wolf Creek has accommodated for us has been amazing. We have everyday families, we have very young families, we have families that have kids with disabilities, and those can be particularly touching. We've had one family that had five children, two of those kids are in wheelchairs, and dad was going out on his third deployment. And they take it in stride because it's everyday life for them, and they're, they're out there in the wheelchairs dancing with dad just like everybody else. But the entire family makes these sacrifices for our freedom that we tend to take for granted. The Ogden Valley community has really embraced this program. We use volunteers to help facilitate all the meals throughout the weekend. So we ask people to volunteer for one meal, and they help set it up and serve it and then clean it up. But the real benefit is the connection they make to these families. We've had one family that came to the retreat. The wife actually ended up on the Ellen DeGeneres show. She had written a letter and they, they brought her in. They have just been hugely touched by the retreat program and, and have said that it has made such a huge impact on their life. This retreat, it's kind of a last shot for some folks. You've been on three or four deployments, the, the family or the marriage isn't, isn't working. For some folks, it's their last shot.